to my love took it down I climbed a mountain and I turned around and I saw my reflection in the snow covered hay. at the end of week five Mike and Rach and June are starting to separate from the pack Everybody else is lost in a sea of three and twos and two and threes. And then there's Vandrew. Run DNC beat Team Merrimy. In town business, lost to the Fast and the Flurious in the lowest scoring match of the week. Congratulations to Chuck Smith for winning Owner of the Week. Mike, do it for the kids and bless them, Makua celebrated his last week with James Connor blowing out the Wompton Super Scrubs. Mike moves up to 4 and 1. Hoodat Woodat Nation took advantage of his team Vandrew by week and moved up to 2 and 3. Team by week beat the Seda Steelies, knocking Tanny Davenport down into the endless sea of 2 and 3 teams. Mocha D Light just didn't have enough to beat Team Davenport. John avoided moving down to 1-4 and, and got the W. In a matchup that broke many hearts, <sighs> Nelson Mambella lost by one point to the grind. Going into Monday night, Team Nelson Mambella needed 15 points from a kicker and a running back. Will Lutz and Adrian Peterson, 15 points. Is that too much to ask? I guess so. Who do I have to Despite the Sunday night scary attempt at a veto, the trade between Lisa and Mike, in which Lisa receives James Conner and Nick Chubb for Julian Edelman, was processed. Will Team Run DNC have a better shot at beating Mike, setting him back to 4 and 2 now that Mike doesn't have James Conner? A girl can dream. David continues to rob Uncle Noli blind, in which he received a decent wide receiver for a borderline QB2. And here's a trade that maybe we should veto. Josh Gordon, who has some really good upside, is being traded for Ty Montgomery, who really belongs on the waiver wire. So, just some food for thought. Don't forget to vote. Register to vote. Let your voice be heard. Ah, that's better. In other news, I extracted my first set of teeth this week. Well, that does it for this week. Good luck this weekend, and don't forget to... Dry rub your meat. Good night.